Peace and blessings. Welcome to Spiritual Healing. I go by the name Yogi Drawback. Namaste. Let the healing begin. Oh, open up and let the love flow in. Let hope and joy come and destroy your suffering. Oh, let the Today is a beautiful day, a sunny day, not that cold. I felt like sharing with you about the difference between religion and spirituality. The reason I want to share with you about this is because I had a chat with one of my brothers who is a devotee of one of the Abrahamic faith. So as we were talking about this, we had some differences and uh, I would say there was a little bit of confusion according to me on what is religion and what is spirituality. Religion emphasizes more on faith, religious scriptures, texts, some kind of ritual, prayers, they even have a specific day where they hold their devotional service. And spirituality on the other hand, it's uh, more focused on mental purity coupled with wisdom and uh, with religion one can uphold a wrong belief without analyzing it or having any sense of reasoning because of being afraid of uh, some kind of a punishment from god or even afraid of losing their faith so they don't genuinely practice whatever that they are practicing, whether it's goodness or helping the other being or doing whatever goodness that they do because of the goodness of their heart, but because of being afraid of something like losing their faith or punishment. So with religion, if I might make an example, is that um, when I pinch myself, I feel pain at this moment. So I would know that if I do the same thing that I did to myself to the next person, he or she will feel the same pain. So I would know that doing this is wrong or right, you know? So this is how spirituality goes. You don't have to know that something is wrong because you have studied it from a certain book. Spirituality is about intuition. It's about uh, experience and practice with spirituality before accepting any belief or any truth we study it we investigate it and practice and see the results in the end if they resonate with us so that's how spirituality goes like um, you, you do a deep analytic investigation and gain some kind of confidence in that truth as we have verified it for ourselves you know if you're a spiritual person you do have that confidence because you do think deeply research and make sure that this is the right way for me this is the right path for me to practice so as spiritual beings we must therefore give a chance to our minds to think independently and understand things in their correct perspective because um, some religious people they are lazy to study a problem in depth simply do not try to understand things as they really are and they just seek an easy way out by surrendering themselves to religion because they have no self-confidence in themselves so this is the, the the kind of challenges that we having as uh, spirit beings in this universe because of being lazy to research this kind of information we find that we throw ourselves into these religions because we are so lazy to study and research information for ourselves a spiritual person on the other hand has self-respect knowing fully well that he or she is responsible for his or her actions and salvation 
so yeah um this is just what i wanted to share with you guys today and it's because i had this conversation with a brother of mine and i was like hmm maybe i should just share this on youtube so that i can hear what you guys think about this please comment below and don't forget to like share subscribe to this channel and may you continue to have a blissful life i'm sending love and light to you guys and a joyful life namaste hotep rastafari